This is Morgana Key, and I'm only about a year late to the party with the Fallout 4 Limited Edition Mystery Box. Except it's not really a mystery because we all know what's in it. When this first came out, it was something stupid, like £60. I, thankfully by waiting, I have managed to get it off eBay for £12. This is why you wait. This is indeed why you wait. It's quite heavy and it's a very large box. And if we flip it over, there's our Bethesda logo. Trademark 2015 and all that jazz. Manufactured by Think Geek Solutions. Made in China. It's a very nice box at the very least. But is the stuff inside it equally nice? You bastards. The box is half empty because this is just a piece of cardboard. A piece of yellow cardboard taking up half of the box. So once you've taken that out, that... Oh, and there's more. There's more cardboard. So yeah, yeah, there is literally three things in this box. So I am very glad I did not fork out £60 for this when it first was out. So what's in it? We've got three things... Let's have a go. Right, the first thing that fell out is a Nuka-Cola bottle opener. We always need bottle openers. I say that, but we don't really need bottle openers because we don't really drink stuff that comes out of bottles. We drink cans of cider and bottles of wine. Anyway, <laughs> Nuka-Cola. Oh, and I drink peach snaps, of course, which also doesn't need to be open with a bottle like this. It's, uh, it's shiny. It's cold to the touch and it's got Bethesda embossed in it. Oh, and you can see me behind the camera. Hello. Uh, it's a nice enough little thing. Very solid, very sturdy. But really, Bethesda, you are just solidifying my thought that this box was a massive rip-off. But getting it for £12, I'm really not going to complain. Next, we've got a thing. I believe it's a T-shirt. You can put that on your arm when someone dies. It's the Nuka Cola lady. Uh, the Nuka Cola alien lady from outer space. Oh, it's uh, a nice fabric y. Well, of course, it's fabric y. It's a nice feeling fabric. Uh huh. It's a good print as well. It's a good quality print, and it wants to friggin' be for that price. Sorry, I'm just totally flinging out the contrast on this camera. Uh huh. So we've got the Nuka Cola lady with a gun and some stars, and it's all stuck together. Is that the heat change in transit, I wonder? It's got the sort of 50s pin up girl vibe to it. At one point, my brother wanted to get a tattoo of a pin up girl, but he never did. <laughs> So here's another one he can consider. I was saying that he doesn't like Fallout. Well, he's never actually played Fallout. How could you go through your life and not have played Fallout? We need to start uh, badgering him on Twitter. He needs to play Fallout. And of course, you can't have anything Fallout without a bobblehead. And that is the perception symbol. Eye, ear, tongue, nose, hand. Old boy bobblehead. Uh, executive issue only commemorative Voltec bobblehead 2077 and on the bottom we've got all the real copyright data and such uh, oh that actually says intelligence bobblehead 7 inch ok I'm confused why is that a picture of perception but on the bottom it says intelligence the intelligence logo is um, thought boy reading a book isn't it? Well, we'll soon see. Open it up and we'll see what he's doing. Yeah, that's definitely perception. Definitely perception because he's looking. He's got his hand to his head and he's looking. Oh, that's embossed. That's nice. The one we got with the limited edition of Fallout 3 was just printed. So it wasn't embossed. So they've improved on the bobbleheads. Got a nice little wobbly head. Bit of paint run off on his hand. But other than that, 
Oh, even the numbers on his back are embossed as well. And on the bottom, we've got copyright gumph. So, for the <laughs> magical total of like 60 quid, the morons paid when it first came out, they got a bobblehead, they got a t shirt, and they got a bottle opener. But for me, waiting a year and paying £12, you can't really go wrong for £12, can you?